Summertime is on its way. We are going to feel heat, humidity, and throw in some popcorn thunderstorms. So just treat it like it's you know, June or July instead of the middle of May. You're looking out this evening, we're starting off really well. That's the scene for Thursday Night Live. Your St. Joseph Health weather bug camera located at the 21C Museum Hotel, and it is get setting the stage here for a Thursday Night Live where it'll be nice and warm down there, comfortable. It's not overly hot yet. We'll save that for a little bit later in the forecast. So on the max track, there are some small chances to end our dry spell. Not many, but they're around. We'll talk about that in the eight day. Overall, there are just not many rain chances coming in. And in the eight day, there's a whole lot of summer showing up. Interesting here. This is the US drought monitor, which is something that's been around since 1990, or excuse me, since 2000. And what we're showing you here is the absolute lack of drought. In fact, the yellow, which is just considered to be a dry spell, not even drought, only 9% of the country, which means 91% of the country is normal or above. In the 20 years that this has been around, it's never happened. So this is really something amazing. But We've got a little tiny dry spell getting going here. This is looking at meteorological spring. So that's March, April and May to date in Lexington. We're running about an inch and two thirds below normal. About same story in Jackson. Look at London, more than four inches below normal. But you go to Frankfurt and Louisville and well, Cincinnati for that matter. It's wet. So our chances for ending the dry spell. Not much going on locally right now in the Max Track Live Dot, but we can find some thunderstorms in central Indiana, some severe weather near the Illinois Indiana line and some of those storms have been really nasty this afternoon some tornadoes about west of Chicago. We've been watching that line diving southward. Thing is, it should turn a little bit more to the right with time and also begin to weaken as it approaches us. But as we continue through the night, there's midnight. There's your warm front well to the north. We're sitting pretty much OK here. New batch of storms will fire up well to our north. Those begin diving southward as we head into the early morning hours tomorrow. Thing is, those will also be dying as they get here. The better chances of rain from that north and northeast. Once those showers are gone, we get you on into Friday afternoon, hot and humid. Welcome to summertime. We're going to continue that on into Saturday. Enough moisture is going to be around that we could see those isolated summertime pop up thunder showers, but again, few and far between. Main batch of severe weather's out here. And yeah, mid May, a week before Memorial Day, and we're still talking snow in the Dakotas. Look at the heat. We're talking low and mid 80s tomorrow, middle, upper 80s as we get you through the weekend. We stay into the 80s well into next week. Right now we're sitting at 79 in Frankfort, 76 in Flemingsburg and Jackson, 77 out of Somerset, Monticello and Williamsburg each at 81. 78 at the Bluegrass Airport, southwest wind comes in at 14. Don't forget the kickoff for Lemonade Days comes up May 31st. LemonadeDays.org. Go to our website as well. Sponsored by Highbridge Springs for our kickoff for that. And again, it's kids helping kids. It is the most wonderful thing to watch happen. Partly to mostly cloudy, isolated thunderstorms will drop to the low 60s tonight. Partly to mostly sunny, isolated thunderstorms again tomorrow. It's a chance most of us stay dry. Low 80s, mid 80s Saturday, middle upper 80s on Sunday. Heat, humidity, they are in abundance. And election day at this point does look dry. Which is a good thing. Everybody good needs thing. to get out there and exercise their right to vote. Absolutely. Bill, thank you. Yep.